What's up guys, KJ Trading here with another video today. Um, it's going to be an educational video. I'm going to be going over basically margin accounts for uh, trading. So let's get started. So what is a margin account for trading? Oh, let me click this real quick. There we go. So what is margin first of all? Um, well, margin is a type of account with a brokerage. <clears throat> um where they allow you to borrow money that you actually don't have in your account to use it in a trade so a good example of this is let's say i have five thousand dollars in my account but i want to get into a trade and use seven thousand dollars so it's two thousand more dollars than i actually have in my account but if you have margin they'll actually allow you to get to that trade so how much margin do you get so with TD Ameritrade, um, they have a one to one and a half margin ratio, which means um, whatever your account balance is, you will get one and a half times that in margin to use. So a good example of this is if I have a $10,000 account balance, um, TD Ameritrade will allow me to use $15,000 worth um, total in and out of trades, but no more than 15,000 because that would be over the one and a half ratio. Um, if it's not perfect like this number, I don't know why that comma's there. Um, so let's just say I had $12,457 in my margin account, and I want to figure out how much margin I actually have. So what you got to do is multiply your balance by 150%, and that will give you your total buying power in your margin account. So in this case, I would actually have $18,685.50 to use in any trade I want in this scenario. So TD Ameritrade gives instant settlements. Now this is really good for margin accounts. Um, so what is instant settlements? Well, it is basically, it means that when you take a trade and either make money or lose money, that the money that you made or lost is instantly added or subtracted to your available balance. Um, this is really good for day trading. So an example of this is if my margin account had $10,000 and I get into a trade and make a profit of $300, then my available balance will be now $10,300. And now I can go into a trade and use all that if I wanted to. And let's say I did, and I get into a trade and lose $700, then my account balance will now only be $9,600 to trade with because I actually lost it. And it's instantly settled. So that's actually how much I have to use to trade with. So the PDT rule. So what is the PDT rule? Well, the PDT rule stands for pattern day trading rule. And this is only active on margin accounts under a minimum level of $25,000. If you have less than this, then you are subject to the PDT rule. And you can only make three day trades every five Three day trades every five rolling trading days. I'll get into that in a second what that means. So example, I make a day trade on Monday. Um, pay close attention to this because it might be confusing. I'm explaining the three trades every five rolling trading days. So I make a day trade on Monday and another day trade on Thursday. You are given three day trades every five rolling trading days. So I would only have one day trade left since I day traded twice already within those five trading days. So Monday and Thursday. So my Monday trade will replenish five trading days after the day I bought it. So Tuesday is one day after. Wednesday is two days after. Thursday is three days after. Friday is four days after. And then back to Monday again is five days after. So Tuesday, I will have that trade available to use again if I'm under $25,000. Um, I'll go a little more in depth than this on this side. So PDT rule simplified. If you do not have over $25,000, you will not be able to make unlimited amount, um, of day trades whenever you want. You will only, um, you're only allowed to have three day trades every five rolling trading days, at least on TD Ameritrade. So if you make a day trade, you have to wait eight days from the day you bought it 
and then that's when you'll get that day trade back into your account. So at TD Ameritrade's Drink or Swim platform, which is the best platform to use from them, um, it will actually tell you how many days you have. So now I'm sure you're asking, well, what if I have over $25,000 in my margin account, or what if I did? So you'd be able to have unlimited amount of day trades, which means you can trade as much as you want every single day for as long as you want. And you'll also have instant instant settlements, just like if you didn't. Uh, that still means whatever you make or lose will instantly be into your account balance so you can trade with it. Um, so you can have a $25,000 account and make 2000 in just an hour and then go and use that money. You can go use 27000 in a trade. That's why if you have over $25,000, I would highly recommend getting this margin account. If you don't, I would not. And I'll get into that later in this video. <clears throat> so what to take away from um, margin accounts? If you have a margin account under $25,000, you will be subject to the PDT rule and will only have three day, tra day trades available every five rolling trading days. Um, and if you have over 25 grand, then you really have a really good account here because you can trade as much as you want. You get instant settlements. Um, you get instant settlements on under 25K, but since you can trade as much as you want, it's really just a huge factor for this, especially for day trading. Um, and if you can only get a margin account, if you have at least 25,000, it will just save you lots of time. You won't have to wait for your stupid trades to get re-uploaded so you can actually take a trade. Um, if you are if you don't have 25 grand, I recommend you get a cash account instead. And I'll go over, go over this in another video. Um, there should be a card popping up somewhere around the top right corner. You can click it if you want to go learn about cash accounts. But if you do have over 25 grand and you're looking to trade, I highly recommend getting a margin account. Um, did you get any value out of this video? So if you got any value out of this video, make sure to subscribe because you don't want to miss out on any of my future content. I'm going to be having lots and lots of future videos coming out, teaching about all different subjects um, over trading, um, basically everything to do with trading. So make sure to subscribe. You don't want to miss out on any future content. There's plenty to learn here. Um, and with that, thank you for watching. I hope you have a great rest of your day.